Hello and welcome back to my another tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to share with you how to set up HP ColorJet Pro MFPM277 DW printer driver with your computer. So let's take a look how to do that. In order to do that, I will suggest you to you have, if you buy this printer new, please be follow the guidelines to uh, unbox properly and then make printer ready for use. And here you will see uh, this printer is free and add some paper if you had with you and later on you're going to pay, uh, print a test press. Even this printer also give you option for a test press print. So we'll uh, add some paper here. So we're going to add some paper here and then we're going to close the table. So now we will uh, put this printer power cable and USB cable. In this printer back side you will see this is the power cable place and this is the uh, printer uh, connector. I hope inside the box you already got a power cable and also you already got a, a this printer uh, cable which is like this. If it is not, you cannot uh, configure this printer with your computer. So if it is not, you have to buy one from the retailer shop. Now I'm going to add this printer cable, uh, power cable here like this. And then also I'm going to add this uh, printer connector backside right over here. And here we're going to turn on this printer by pressing this power button. And then we can see this printer is turned on here. We can see this printer status and the sound is up here. And also one thing's more, uh, this is the printer USB cable. We will connect this uh, USB cable later on whenever we're going to install this printer. Uh, this uh, printer uh, software will uh, tell you to connect this USB cable. So one thing's more, you might be uh, not have this printer uh, driver with you or maybe like me uh, my laptop there is no supported dvd driver so if you also are getting dvd driver with this printer box you cannot add this dvd driver also maybe your computer dvd driver damage and you would like to install this printer with your computer what you can do for that case i will share with you how you can easily uh, download this driver from the internet Without, uh, if you lose the printer CD or etc., you can easily install this printer driver uh, and download that internet software, download over the internet that software and you can easily install in your computer. Now we're going to open our favorite web browser and here we're going to type our printer model. Our printer model is HP MFP M277 DW. And then we're going to type here driver. We'll see it's give us option batteries website. We'll choose the first one which is support.sp.com, which is HP original website. So you're going to click here and you will see the software website is appear, and you can see here it's writing recommended. That means this will be recommended for you it for using or installing this software using all the services. So I'm going to click here download and then let me see what is coming next. It will give you option to click save. So I'm going to click here save and it's going to be a download. It's depend on your internet speed and obviously one thing's more I will put this website link directly for this particular driver for this printer model. You can directly jump and uh, click and jump over this website and you can directly download this software you can see here already this software is downloaded in my computer now you can choose here open folder or either you can choose here run so i'm going to click here run list the software exist or list this software run in my computer and later on i can install this software in my computer and later on i can use this printer you can see there is a extracting 
and also you can see there is a launch HP installer now we can see here it's giving us option to software selection you can see here there is writing required we're going to choose this one which is a scan driver MFP M277 scan driver required so I'm going to choose this one and then I'm going to click here next and here also I have to choose this I have read and accept by install agreement again I have to click here next here you can see the preparing to install this might take several minutes please wait so we'll be wait let's see what the second step we have to click here next and now we can see the software you can use by a uh, different way to install we're going to use this direct connect this computer using a usb cable so i'm going to click here next and you can see now it's giving to connect to the usb cable now now we will connect this usb cable that we had connected with our printer so i'm going to click here connect this usb cable you can see and whenever i'm going to connect you'll see this same product has been detected connect successfully now it's going to be installing in my computer so we'll see what's the next step we can see setting the uh, software is successfully installed and now it's giving you additional option for the product you can click set as default printer right we can see it's a pair check okay we'll keep it as it is and also you can see here it's setting print a test space that means whenever you're going to uh, like click next it's going to be a print a test space also it's going to make this printer as a default printer we can see here there is a, a test document is print out just now you can see that's quite impressive so this is how you can easily set up this printer with your computer now we can see the last step is we can see HP connected and register uh, this product with HP. So I'm going to click here, finish. So when I'm going to click here, finish, it's going to open the uh, registration product option. You can register if you want, but myself, I don't want to register. So I'm going to close this skip. Now we'll see what else. We're going to click here next. And you can see a help HP design product you want. You can choose your preferred country and then you can say which is the primary use. So I'm going to choose home. And how many printer do you have? I'm going to choose one and submit. This is like additional setup. It's not necessary, but you can do so help submit HP. Here you can see uh, this printer. Here we can see a shortcut key which is HP CLM277 scan, which is will help you to scan document by this printer you can easily insert any paper here or also you can use this feeder for scan any document and you can save that document as a pdf or jpeg but i'm not going to do that i'm going to click here exit and let me go on control panel and let me see on hardware and sound device and printer and here we will see just now i had installed my printer and I will see it is here. Also, you can see whenever you click here, it will give here a fair default. That means just default. If it is not default, you can just right click over there and click here, set as default printer. Now, let me test a printout a document test space. So, I'm going to click here, open my word, and then I'm going to choose a blank document. And here, I'm going to type my channel name. Now, I'm going to click here, file, and click here, print, and then here we will see just now i had set up my printer it is set up already here and this is the printer default printer already set now i'm going to click here print and let me see is it printing or not i can see there is a printer sound up here and there is something print out so that's pretty good so this is how you can easily print uh, uh, or configure this hp laserjet mfp 277dw with your computer so that's for now. Thanks for watching my video. See you next one. Peace.